They're scrapping B-52 bombers, and the purpose of this YouTube short is to understand the logic behind the decision made by the United States to decommission 375 B-52 aircraft through the utilization of a 13,000-pound steel blade. So, in 1991, the signing of the Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty marked a significant milestone. As part of their commitments under this treaty, the United States assumed the responsibility of dismantling a total of 375 B-52s, necessitating their disassembly into smaller components. The components were then arranged at the Boneyard for a duration of three months, with the primary objective of allowing the Soviet Union to confirm the destruction of the B-52s by satellites. Irreparable in nature, this circumstance arose due to a mutual consensus between the United States and the Soviet Union throughout the 1990s, wherein both nations acknowledged the excessive possession of nuclear armaments, alongside a surplus of bomber aircraft and submarines, capable of delivering such weaponry. The treaty blocked its signatories from deploying more than 6,000 nuclear warheads and a total of 1,600 ICBMs and bombers.